up, players? <laughs> Guess it just made it back in my life. Yo, what's up, players? What is good, fam? How are we living? The crowd is yeah. your boy Dale! Oh, today is such a good day. We're going to Simi Valley right now. We're spending the entire day skating and filming and hanging out with Brody. It's gonna be awesome. These are the days I always look forward to. It's been a crazy last three days. Um, sort of on vacation, but just hustling in San Francisco. And now we're in LA getting it back in our hometown, forgetting about every struggle that life has to offer because we're skateboarding. And that is so awesome. Is that? And guess who the second guest of the day is? Woo! Brody! It has been such a long minute since you guys have seen this beautiful face. And I actually drove up to his area today for us to go street skating. I'm so happy. And it happens to be right next to the skate park right here. But we're too core and street and urban to care about the skate park. I've had something in the mail that I just stumbled upon recently, but these are socks. They're actually from Footprint Insole, and I didn't want to shout them out because this isn't a pay thing at all, but I always appreciate new technology in skateboarding, especially ones that actually help out with the activity. Now, the unique things about these is that they have actual padding where your shins are, and if you're a skateboarder, dude, the amount of shin damage is so ridiculous that we have to go through and just, you know what, look at my shins. The whole thing is so gross. It's all indented as well. I've literally been tempted to buy shin guards. I used to wear them in Taekwondo or just soccer shin guards in general and wear them while I'm skateboarding, but I think there has been an alternative created and I appreciate that. <laughs> As you can see, they have this protective shield inside. It's this little padding right here. It's about the same width as an insole for your shoes. It runs down the entire leg to here and connects to some pads right here that also support your ankles. I didn't know about the ankle supports beforehand, but that's also a huge thing in skating where the board hits my ankles, which probably happens more often than the shins. So apparently these cover the whole basis. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is real. I'm actually doing this and it doesn't hurt Even though this is horrifying that goes against all natural instincts as a skateboarder to hit your shins intentionally But not feel any pain whatsoever. I Know you're thinking it's not that hard at all, but as skateboarders They've gotten so sensitive over the years even when I touch my shins it hurts a little bit So this is really nice and when it comes to flexibility it feels fine so far. Uh, this is extremely dope I'm gonna try to do a couple tricks and see if I notice that I'm wearing these socks at all. Zoom, dramatic. Zoom, zoom, dramatic. Right, engagement, ready? engagement. Zoom, dramatic. All right, ready. All right, I'm just gonna do literally like a 5 pop out and then a kick book. All right, cool. On this ledge right here. All right, cool. That's amazing. I commented like come to board your skate park so many times. Oh no <laughs> way! Hey, I, didn't, I didn't even know what this was until today. It's my yeah, first dude. time ever seeing it. Were you guys at Noah's Bagels like? Yeah, earlier today. Okay, so I saw your story, right? And I was like, 
Oh, like, oh, I, we haven't noticed bagels here. Like, it looks kind of like ours. And I was like, maybe the, like, that'd be cool. We actually, we weren't <laughs> even at, we weren't even at this one. We were the one yeah. in Culver oh, really? City. Yeah. Oh, God. yeah. It just happened to work out. Yeah. That's super <laughs> weird. I don't think we're supposed to be in here. <laughs> right, when Dale walks out, I'm scared. Do you want to tell me? Yeah. You find out he's just like pooping. <laughs> Bruh. No! <laughs> you didn't even flex. Reaction bro. video. <laughs> you didn't even flex, bruh. I literally didn't scare you at all, did I? No, because I knew something was happening. Oh, because it was all quiet? Well, Andy he pointed the camera right away. Oh, so. <laughs> something's going on here. It's like light outside. There's. I don't like how much you're bragging kids. about being brave, dude. I'm a brave I'm man. a scary boy, bro. Mike Mo. Woo! Final consensus about the socks. I absolutely. Love consent. them. We absolutely consent. Stole your thunder. Sorry. I hate you so much. I absolutely recommend them. I think they're great. I think it's amazing in skateboarding when there's a new product introduced because that is very rare. It's very exciting, especially new technology. And I do appreciate that Footprint Insoles sees value in influencers and reaches out, sends product to me, all my friends. They send Braille stuff all the time. But you know what? I kind of want that paycheck. They don't send me money. Bitch. Probably shouldn't make this video, right? <laughs> Kudos to any company out there actually introducing new technology to skateboarding. Much appreciated, bless up family. But we're gonna take it to the streets right now and see how they operate in the street. I love you, mom. <laughs> Brody, dude, can I please give you the highest of fives for filming all of that? Of course, dude. Thank you so much. Killed it today. Maybe a little. Maybe a little higher. There Earth, she is. Earth's flat, so we can go a little higher right now. <laughs> also, Mike Osterman just showed up, and dude, this little flat ground game. I just tried to do a couple tricks for his channel. Uh, it was kind of ridiculous because I have no idea what I'm doing. But his board is so much fun because this is what a freestyle board looks like in general. Or is this a little different than a regular freestyle board? Uh, this is like a standard, I'd say. This okay, is like cool. The usual freestyle shape. So, so what's unique about it? It's it's flatter, right? Yeah. So it has a flat nose. We call this a single kick board. Okay. So uh, having a flat nose is good for certain tricks like pogos, caspers, flat. Dale's a flat earth guy. He's, yeah, uh, he's yeah. He's a flat earther. So he's a. You guys didn't know. I drive from the gas station to my house all the time, and it is flat. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, also, so you have these two, and yeah, then you also true. have. What's, it, what's this for? Little grip tape for Casper. So when I have my foot over the nose, it doesn't slide off. It also covers up something I don't want to have on my board. Uh, he's a pro and his name's on his board and he's hiding it. It's weird to see a board with your name on it, man. Dude, it's sick. Are your name's on that? Yes. Uh, where? On he's hella pro. Exactly where. It's underneath that part. <laughs> he hides his name, dude. It's dude, his name's Mode? <laughs> Whoa! Well, he said he's gonna do a few flagground tricks for this channel, so super appreciative. Towards this, let's see what you got. vlog now today has been a great day it's kind of a I think we filmed like a lot a lot and of course I'll put all these dudes links in the description below if you want to check them out it's freaking it's all youtubers gang, it's a YouTube gang. policy today gang gang flat earth gang gang okay dude you keep that flat earth business out of here dad Dale thinks he's Shaq now. Dale's so inspired by Shaq that he's a flat earth believer now. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Tune in tomorrow to see the rest of what we do today. The reason I'm in this vlog early is because I already know that I filmed so much, so much fun content. Today is like a full on skate day. So undeniably, so obviously we're gonna film a lot of content today. It's gonna be amazing. So tune in tomorrow to see Dale and I skating a bunch of different things. I actually have a really fun idea for tomorrow's video. So stay tuned, you guys roll. It's been amazing. 
Holy crap, I'm so happy to be skateboarding again, full on. Love you so much, progress daily, and keep killing it. Oh,